Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am Amber and this is Outer Wilds. We are back <laughs> with Outer Wilds. So I think by now there's probably been a few other videos that have <laughs> come out before this one. Maybe there's been a bit of a break since the last part of this. I don't do well with deadlines, so I'm just preemptively filming this apology. It's probably very relevant, relevant isn't it? Editor Amber. So, <laughs> yeah, but we're back today. Um, I'm feeling a bit run down. Bear with. I'm looking down because I have a list. So when I was editing the last episode, I kind of had a few more like little pieces light up in my brain about things that I wanted to try or kind of ideas or theories that I had. So I thought I'd run through a couple of them now. I thought, I mean, I haven't looked side by side, so this, <laughs> this first one could be way off the mark. But the supernova, to me, looks like that no my symbol I keep seeing. Um, so now I'm thinking that this eye of the universe or whatever they were looking for is, are they searching for the, the time when maybe their sun would explode or our sun would explode? And maybe that's why they're searching through time to find out when it happens so that they can try and save themselves. This is this is my guess for the Numai so far. Uh, I noticed that the white hole station looked different at different times in the in the time span in the loop. So uh, earlier on, there's not much debris. Um, so I found that interesting and I think that the southern observatory on brittle hollow broke and then fell through the black hole when i was on it i didn't realize when i was playing but um when editing i then realized like oh shit that piece broke off and i fell through it uh so that's interesting so there's a time limit on i'm guessing when i can explore that i can't leave it too late because then it just fall through the black hole maybe i could still run around it although i assume not once we're at White Hole Station. I wanted to jetpack in the geyser that I <laughs> fell in and died in in the very first episode. So I think I'll probably do that straight away in this episode. And I want to go back to Ash Twin and do more exploration, like racing against the sand on both sides of the planet. Also, they spoke about the phantom moon disappearing and the rocks in the cave disappear. And they they have the, uh, what do you call it? It's like quantum something. <laughs> in my little signal scope scanner. So I'm thinking, did pieces of the moon break apart and crash into the planet? And maybe I'll be able to find the moon by using that quantum signal scope entry so i thought about trying that today i also had a thought if i were to like sit or stand on one of those rocks i don't think the character can close their eyes but maybe like look up like look away from the rock would i then phase with it or would it just disappear beneath my feet does that make sense because you've got to like look away and look back um i wonder if i would go away with it and is that what happened to the person that they spoke about that went missing i have forgotten their name <laughs> so anyway those are my current thoughts, theories, things that I want to try so far. Because the last two, you know, episodes, I just sort of, just sort of been running around and taking it in, which was very relaxing, very fun. Well, I say relaxing, it was bloody terrifying. <laughs> it makes me scared, this game. I feel so small. Everything feels... Because I have no idea what's going to happen. Things keep, I don't know, jump scaring me or just frightening me. It's it's a really cool experience. Uh, so yeah, that's the plan for today. Hope you're all sitting comfy and chill and yeah, let's just get going with this. But yeah, thank you so much for supporting the channel and for watching the series. If you've come off of the back of Hollow Knight, welcome in. I hope you really like this episode and this series too. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching everyone and let's just play. <gasps> <gasps> Indeed. Right. Let me go get my jetpack.
Oh. Um, moves when I'm not watching. I can follow it on the signal scope. So I thought about trying to find the moon that way. I wonder how an anglerfish got there. Interesting. This is such a good way for me to wrap my brain around all this information. <laughs> all these entries. There's a model for these towers. Oh! Like the ring shape. More to explore here. Okay, I'll go back. That's fair enough. I knew. I think I knew that. Well, I fell through the black hole with the Southern Observatory. Power of quantum knowledge. Okay. Quantum moon. Oh, yes. Possibly to an unknown sixth location. Very interesting. Well, I'm gonna have a little look for that today, I think. Don't know if I'm ready for <laughs> Giant's Deep. All right. I have my jetpack. Oh gosh. Oh, I am, I am underwater. Oh, it's pushing me. Oh god, it's so dark in here. Oh no. Oh, this is massive. This is terrifying in here. Jesus. Okay. Should we start on this layer? I think we should. There are people in here. Always filled up with water. Then I guess I could use this to boost myself up, but I don't really think that I want to do that. I'm gonna go further down. I wonder if I've got any, any signals in here. Oh whoa! Oh whoa! That's pushing me way out. Just constantly pushing. Oh, he doesn't want me in there. Oh, I want to know. What a cool little area. Does this push me up? Oh no, this looks like I'm gonna get sucked in. <laughs> Shall I follow it? I am curious where it would go. Let's do it. Where you can take me! Ooh. Ooh! Wait, was that an extra way? Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, dang you. Oh, whoa. Whoa! Oh, they're connected. Oh, shit! Oh, God. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. I was just gonna fall right back in the hole, but I did not. Quick before it pushes me out again. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, no. Wait. Wait right there. Oh, no. Oh, any one of these could push me out. Okay, I'm back in. I think I've seriously hurt my legs, though. Now, where are we? Oh, where am I? Where is this? Is where I originally, originally was? Hmm. No, I don't so yeah this is somewhere new it's so dark i might need to change my brightness oh god that's probably way too bright for everyone but i'm i'm blind i need to have brightness i'm so sorry okay should i follow that up and then come back down to do that probably just leads outside again hmm. but then it feels important because it's got its whole own area Let's see what it's, kicking. it's kicking up here oh my god <laughs> terrifying that i can't see oh here's an interesting zone unidentified signal nearby oh, not landing very well Unidentified signal. Wait, 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 wait. 
No, that's way too far away. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> Grove shard. Okay. Shall I try my my theory? These shards everywhere. I can't even get on it. Let me stand on you. Okay. Here we go. I'm looking away. No. Oh, I just left as soon as I stopped touching it. Hmm. You come back. Oh. Oh. Oh, you're moving around town. Let me see. What if I do this? Ho 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 I wanna see you move. Where did you go? Okay, you're over there. Now when I look back, you're gonna be gone, right? No 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 jump! Right back, Amber. Why'd you do that? Okay. Still there. Still there. Oh, it's not a dummy. It's not a dummy. It knows not to move when I have something on it. Oh wait, but now it's moved. Oh, God, now I'm confused. So it does travel with it. This rock is so confusing. Oh, interesting. Okay, it doesn't go, it knows when I'm taking photos. Wait, I'll stop taking photos. Okay, it doesn't actually care. And now it's moved. Okay, it doesn't move when my... It was moving when my scout was on it. I'm confused. It's cool because it lights it up too. And now it's gone. Okay, so it doesn't like being touched. <laughs> no touch. Right. Doesn't like being touched and followed. Then how did that person disappear? How did they harness your power? I must know. I like this bit. Reminds me like redwood forest trees. I'm very hurt. Ship log updated. Quiet shade. It's always dark across old bark in the ancient glade. It's always dark here. Such tall trees. How interesting. Who wrote that? Enjoy that. Ooh. In the ancient glade, across old bark, the quiet shade, it's always dark. Oh no. Oh no, is this a riddle? Not if I put my light scout here it's not always dark i'm gonna leave it on it <laughs> torture it it can't disappear when it's <laughs> when i have that on it wait a second where did the other side go or did i just read the sign wrong oh, i always go check it wait. the sign doesn't travel does it Travels. What? It's always dark in the ancient glade in the quiet. Can I? Oh, you don't like me touching you, do you? It's always dark in the ancient glade, the quiet shade across all old bark. And it was just here. Oh my god, this thing is so freaky. How did they transfer power to the sign? Should I follow this? Of fuel. Maybe I should save it for an emergency. Oh, it's hard to get up here then. Where 
Oh, where are we? Oh, let's jump. I know. I've been jumping around too much. I always forget that I'm on a fuel limit. Oops. And a time limit. I didn't even set a timer. So, <laughs> the sun is going to surprise me again. I get to watch everything go down. Well, the sun is here, but it's always dark in the shade of the park. No, I don't remember it. Ooh, what do you say? Chat's research notes. Property of chat. I've detected a strange signal coming from somewhere within the grove in this crater. It's very similar to the signal emitted by the quantum moon, so it stands to reason that the two signals are probably related. We don't know much about the quantum moon, seeing as no one's ever been able to land on it, but hopefully studying the signal in the grove will reveal more about it. I mean, I can stand on the shard. It just, it doesn't move when something's on it. Which is a bit annoying. Oh, well, I probably shouldn't do that. Now. Um, shall I try and just walk all the way? Should I just try and walk all the way home? Let me get to the other side. Over here. Gently. Oh, God. <laughs> I, re I haven't walked around, have I? There are just a few scattered trees. Mm, you're looking hotter by the second. And that's not a compliment. <laughs> I'm scared of you. Stop following me. My goodness. I don't want the grove shard. I don't want the cave shard. Why would be you? You. The moon's gonna be there, isn't it? Oh no, wait, that probably, probably just something else on that planet. Well, White Hole Station's looking <laughs> pretty battered. And the interloper's on its way. Shard. I just think I'm going to be able to make that. Oh. Did it! Well, feeling much better now. Okay, let me, let me read this. And let me read this. Quantum Road. The strange rock shard in the grove that moves when I'm not watching, it emits a signal on the quantum fluctuations frequency. Found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove, which also moves around. Did you make note of the poem? Apparently not. Who wrote the poem? I kind of want to go back. Let me take my ship there. Let me light you up. With the power of oh whoa, what is that? That's all wrong. Oh, that's the moon. Oh god, forgot I was flying. <laughs> I forget that it moves if I don't do anything. Which is quite funny. Okay, how would you feel about me lighting you up with all of this? Light. Alright. Oh, what's the thing about this? What's the thing about this? No, I can't get you to just sit here, can I? Hmm. Good point. I should go in landing mode. Should I land in there? I really like this up. <laughs> <laughs> ah, 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 
Yes! I didn't think landing on that bit's a good idea. Okay, now this is pretty bright. Ah! Oh, it's because the thing exploded on me. <laughs> God dang it! I, did, I thought I missed it! I suppose my ship's much bigger than what I thought. <laughs> I'm too scared to land in there again. I'm too scared to land in there again. Can I land in a tree? This looks very fuzzy. Ooh, I can. Have fun. Oh gosh. Oh, oh, don't do it. Slowly. Slowly. Oh, ah. God. I said slowly. Right now, where'd it go? Was it not here? What? Ow. Oh, oh my God. What? Ooh. I come to the wrong place. No, this definitely is the right place. Oh. Unless. <gasps> oh my God. It moves too! Oh, that is really cool. I'm going to hurt myself. What? Ouch. I don't know how to land safely. I really don't. Well, I might die down here, but... I'm waiting to go back in. How cool. How did they transfer this power to these objects? That's what I want to know. I'm getting pushed again. Okay, I gotta wait to save myself. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> God dang it! It's so hard to control that. Okay, now. That's so interesting. Does that mean this bit moves as well? Or it's just the bit at the top? But then how does that work? That makes no sense. Oh no, it does move. Oh, whoa. The whole, like, tunnel moves with it. It's really on me. That is so cool. How on earth does that work? Turn around. And the tunnel's gone, too. Where did I come from? I think out of that bit. Let me try going in. I think it's gonna push me out. Yeah, 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 I came out of this bit. All right, well, I'll keep going then. <gasps> I'll keep going then. What a cool little entry. Okay, here we go, here we go. Don't get caught, don't get caught. Oh, 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 no, no, I got caught! Oh, you bastards. Something got me. Oh, careful, 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 careful. Ooh, hello. After closer observation, mining site 2A wouldn't be safe with the native life dwelling in some of this cave's pools. So, unfortunately, we'll have to mine one of the other sites. There are a few other cave sites that look promising. What about Site 2B, as it shares similar uh, formations and strata? Well, you did go to 2B. This sounds promising. Will you and your mentor investigate? If mining Site 2B proves safe for this native species, we'll, work, we'll move our work there. So they cared about other life. Site 2B is safe. Curlia says we'll continue to monitor our activity and its effect on life here. On the opposite hand, new life. This, is, this species is semi-aquatic and very hardy. The ecosystem here is quite robust, so I believe they'll thrive in the long run. Be cautious near the pools if you visit 2A to meet them. Is this like early me? 
<laughs> Ellie, my species? I was watching them once during the rest, and the owls escaped from me. They're fascinating. I wonder what their fourth eye does. <laughs> Hilarious. They remind me of a subterranean species that my mentor, Melari, once told me about. When our clan used to travel across this universe, I imagine she would have enjoyed those life forms greatly. Aww. Ooh. Ooh. Aww. Are they discovering, like, early me? Early my species? What's happening? Wait, so is that upstairs 2A? Oh, this is so cool. Oh, I need to be blasted up. Can I get a lift, please? Okay, okay, I can't see a thing. I can't see a bloody thing! <laughs> I'd like to go up, please. Right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Right. Is this 2A? No, this is 2B. What are they talking about 2A then for? Or is that just down there they wanted to go 2A? How cool. Oh, God. Oh boy. Oh, I didn't want to jump down here earlier, did I? That was super interesting. Is this going even further? Oh, I'm so scary going through this. Oh, let's just do it. I bet it leads back to that original room I was in. With the big fissure in it. Yep. I think it does. And then this goes upstairs, right, to the, the village. Should we wait for our ride? I don't know if these turn up. Is this hot? Oh, here we go. Oh, yep. Oh no, I'm gonna land there. Ah, don't wanna land there. Ghost matter. Ah. Oh, thank you. Elsa's in here. Oh, only one is open. Unless you also move. Oh no, now I've left my ship quite far away. Maybe I should ride you up a little higher. Ghost man come from. I'm just gonna wait for my ride. Where's my ship? Over there. Oh, time to go. Okay, okay, okay. Gently. Gently. Okay. We did it. Now I've got to go back to my ship. <laughs> Every time I find somewhere new, I just leave more questions. No answers here yet. What's with this poem? The sign. Hmm. Well, I guess I did learn that other objects other than the shards can travel. I'm just wondering how that person disappeared. And why, like, what transferred the, the power of the quantum moon travelling, you know? What did it? I don't know. Hmm. Should I go look for it? 
Something there. I don't really want to go to Giant's Deep, to be honest with you. I think there's just something on every planet by the looks of things, yeah. Cave shard. <clears throat> but if it keeps moving, how am I gonna I suppose it should be my ship doing it. Quantum fluctuations. Okay, there's something on there, I'm guessing. I keep feeling like I'm gonna hit something. Where is the sun? <laughs> Where is it? There it is. There it is. Okay. I need not the cave shard. I need to find the moon. I want to find the moon. There's something on Giant's Deep. Something on you we already know about. Every time I turn around, it's just going to change, right? So how am I going to find this damn moon? I wonder if it moves like... Oh, I'm getting really far away from things. I wonder if it moves to like the planets and I just haven't noticed it or something before. Maybe I should just go to each planet and then I can get rid of all the other unknown ones. You know? Because now I can look at this and be like, well, it's definitely not here because it's the museum and the grove and whatnot giving me all the... Oh god. Oh boy. Um, autopilot, are you okay? <laughs> I need you to, to chill. Thank you very much. Okay, now I'm back here. Let's get away from that. Let's get away from there, please. Okay. Quantum fluctuations. Quantum fluctuations. I found it! Oh my god, no, I don't like how close we are to the sun here, though. Whoa! Whoa, 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 Hi. Um, I don't know what to do with you. I'm scared to look away because you're going to move. What do I do with you? You don't look anything like the little rocks we've seen. We've seen. We've seen. Do I just try and land on it? Can I shoot my scout thingy? Can I? God. How do I? Yes. You. Nothing! Why is there nothing? What? Where did it go? Ooh. That's no fair. How close am I to this sun? Oh no, wait, I can't look away. Oh god. Okay, let's just just rotate around this. Try and find the sun. This is freaking me out doing this. I can't I can't do it. Okay, let's just get this back. Okay, there's the sun. There's the sun. There's the sun. This just lo looks like Giant's Deep. I know it's not, but... Where do you go? What do you do? Why don't you... I don't know what to do. Oh, 
Oh, screw it. I'm just gonna try and land on it. Um, okay, velocity matched. Can I not, can I not get out my landing gear? Do I have to do? Actually, closer to it to get out my landing gear. <laughs> Can I not land on it? Oh my god. It's so hard. Oh god. Oh, I'm gonna smash. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Also because the sun is so close. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I know he's gonna be gone. What? Oh my god, touch it. He doesn't like anyone touching it. Could you transport me anywhere? No! What? And I can't stick my signal scope on it to stop it moving and it goes all fuzzy does that mean I was just firing it into the sun but did it just go straight through it where is it going <laughs> I think I'm very far away from the sun but maybe yeah I'm too far away from the sun so then it is when it enters the, the moon. So that doesn't come out the other side. Mm. Let's go back to Timber Hearth while we can, before everything explodes. Because I think it might be soon. I didn't set a timer. Hmm. Let me read this. We've got one, two, three, four, five, I'm guessing it's just going to go in between each of these planets, right? Because it changes location. And the sixth one, obviously, don't know. Maybe that's the eye of the universe? Tower of Quantum Knowledge. How do useful knowledge when am I embarking on their first pilgrimage to the quantum moon? Located on Brittle Hollow's equator, we try and go. Right. I want to find out about this moon. I'm going. <sighs> right. First planet we've seen wake up. I still haven't been there. I'm just really scared of it. It doesn't look or sound very nice. Brittle Hollow. Oh wow, Brittle Hollow looks amazing. <laughs> I just try to avoid the the planet. Brittle Hollow, you look so good right now. Damn. Okay, where is safe for me to land my ship? Because I've only ever been here through. Ooh, what is that? Through travel, through through you know. God, I'm gonna lose my shit in here. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Well, this could be a good place to put it. Retreat here. You know? Landed in a tree. Landed in a tree! Isn't this a, um, yeah, the stress beacon. Is everyone unharmed? No one was badly injured from the escape pod's impact. We're incredibly fortunate. This is good news at least. Have we heard from escape pod 2 or escape pod 3? What were they escaping from? No, I, I'm unable to make contact. My equipment can hear the other two escape pod's distress signals, however. If it's any comfort, both pods must be structurally intact. I'll continue calling for them. My gratitude, if we can attach, the moon is approaching again. Everyone brace yourselves swiftly, volcanic moon has returned. Be cautious of fallen ash and debris. The 
believe the moon has passed. This planet doesn't appear eager to have guests. We are certainly unwelcome on its surface. We need to find shelter and quickly. The volcanic moon won't be gone for long. What's the volcanic moon? I observed several promising sites below the surface, but we'll need to construct a way for everyone to climb down safely. Climb down this cliff safely. I can't read that sentence for some reason. Perhaps we could build platforms? Interesting. I guess I'll follow the, the platforms you made. Okay, you can shift. Oh gosh, you are being hit. Oh. The volcanic moon is that thing that orbits this place and shoots at the surface. I got it. Escape pod one. Vessel has been mortally injured. Emergency sequence activated. Awaiting departure from vessel. Vessel? Escape pod three. Launching escape pod two. Now launching escape pod one. Vision imminent. Preparing for impact. Scan an external environment. Scan complete. Minor structural instability is detected. Pockets of breathable air detected. Adequate solar energy detected. Verdict? Hospitable. Cool, saving. So there's gonna be like another escape pod to find some objects. Bloody hell! Alright, bye bye. Oh god, here are the platforms, I guess. This is gonna go very badly, isn't it? <gasps> oh! Oh, these platforms are not structurally sound. Not, not at all. I do say one hit set, sets it off. I do say. <laughs> Why am I talking like that? This is funny. Use caution. A black hole sleeps below. You must not slip. Well, maybe you should have made better platforms. How old are these things? Oh, for God's sake. Oh, for God's sake. Go, 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 but I am making my way downtown. Which is very exciting. And here we go. Itch. Itchy, itchy, itchy. No. Okay. God, this is immense. I really want to look at it, but I'm terrified of falling down. Eesh. Of note, be sure not to wander far from here. Though this area is somewhat unstable, it's safer than any we've found so far. The temporary settlement is finished, but remember to be cautious of falling rocks and dust created by meteor impacts. Aye aye, Captain. Well, we've lost that bit. This planet? Go, 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 go. Given concerns about our settlement stability, where should we construct a new, less temporary settlement? We need to stay close to the escape pods so Felix can monitor incoming messages. We can't be rescued if we aren't present to respond. I don't believe anyone is coming to save us, Thatch. Now we must save ourselves. I agree. We're here because the eye signal called to us and we followed. If we're to find it, we need not to merely survive, but thrive. This is a wise point, Bloom, and eloquently made. If moving to the southern glacier will keep us safer, then that is what we should do. I believe we should migrate to the northern glacier. What if we use the gravity crystals to craft a stable path? Building beneath the crust again would shelter us from the volcanic moon's eruptions. Do they split off? Different ends, then? I'm right in the middle, aren't I? Oh, I want to explore everywhere. What is this? Oh, that does not look stable. I'm not falling for it. Oh, I have to fall for it, don't I? <laughs> I have to touch it, don't I? Okay, gently, 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 gently! Okay. This knowledge is too dear to lose. Here is everything we can recall about the signal we encountered while aboard the vessel. The signal looked like an eye. Round with a circle at the centre which looked like a pupil. 
I suppose the signal was looking for something. The signal was older than the universe itself. This is the most significant detail. Just looks like the supernova exploding. Okay, well that's good. Shall I try and smash this then? Oh, this is that sensitivity. Oh, it is that sensitive percent. Well, I won't be doing that then. There's too much to explore, I keep getting distracted. Fuck. the hardest part of this tragedy not knowing who we may have lost? Will the hardest part come later when we learn? Be well, Aunt Mer Melorai. Oh, That was someone's mentor. I think we read that earlier? I have to like, like explore quickly because of like the time loop and everything. You know, closing. Everything closing, everything breaking. So, I feel a little bit rushed. It is fun, but I'm, I'm in a constant state of anxiety a little bit. Whoa, what is going on here? Oh my god. Is, what is that? Is that the vessel? And they had a signal from the eye. Oh no, is that dark bramble? Oh no, it attacked them. That's scary. And then the escape pods. Oh no, one's in dark bramble then. Okay. I can't understand. Why did the vessel crash in that place? Oh no, we crashed into it. We. <laughs> I'm embodying them. Was the vessel unwell in some way? No, Anona and I checked before the warp. And the warp core and navigation systems were both well. I'm talking about it as if it's alive. We warped to follow that curious signal from the eye of the universe. Where we arrived was wrong. It wasn't where we tried to go. I suppose it wasn't a problem with the vessel, but with our destination. I'm afraid our friends in Escape Pod 3. Might not have made it. Unless they did in there, that would be really interesting. I don't know how I'm ever gonna be able to explore there properly because um, I can barely fly my ship. <laughs> I can barely fly my ship. Yeah, I'm gonna go up there. Yeah. Sorry, everyone, my controller just disconnected. Um, let's go. We can hear the other escape pods distress signals, which gives me hope. Foley, are you still here? I'm unsure how to survive in this place without you. I'm unsure to oh, how to be me without you. Oh, That's really sad. I'm getting lost. I'm getting a, little, a wee bit lost. I'm conscious that I need to keep on the move. On the move, on the move, on the move. I've been over there. Oh, I missed a read, apparently. No one in my clan has ever encountered anything like it. How can anything in this universe be older than the universe itself? Imagine what rare and profound knowledge it might offer. We must find this eye of the universe. Why? <laughs> Hold on. Why is my mouse appearing? It's annoying me. What? Something weird's going on. Okay, now. Where did I come from and where did I want to go? I can't go this way. Oh god. This is gonna be bad. Oh my god. Oh, is one of these not close enough? Oh! Oh, you bastard! What? Why? Why? Fuck's sake. <laughs> I swear to God, game. I swear, I swear to God. Now what am I gonna do? <laughs> I 
No, I can't click again. Outer Wilds hates me all of a sudden. Oh, there, there she is. But I can't click! <laughs> Screw you! Ugh. Should just quit at this point. I don't think it's going to go very well. And the mouse is back. Do you know what? That's... I'm not having that. Maybe I gotta jump? No. I just gotta make sure I pick the right. See, now that feels too far away. Okay, go, 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 go. This is so scary. This feels too far away from anything. Oh, I don't like it. Maybe it's fine. Maybe I just accidentally put on my jetpack booster. I don't know. Oh god. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Ah, uh, that's so scary. Okay. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep feeling like it's wanting me to turn around. Oh no, not more wall climbing. This is really cool. Really cool. What a way to travel. Okay. <laughs> Don't play me like that. found it. I think we found some more stable settlements. Although everyone's dead on the table. <laughs> Don't know how stable this is. Whoa. Oh my god, they're right above the black hole. They really went for it, didn't they? It's creepy music. Oh no, where is this going? Ooh, thank you, oxygen. Oh no. Hmm. Where is this ghost matter coming from? Dangerous. Okay. I know, I think it's just downstairs, right? It's like a classroom. Explanation of festivals. All the Namai clans from all over the universe meet in one place to share what we've, they've learned in science and art. It's called the festival. Don't forget, festivals happen every 10 years. At some festivals, one clan's big discovery can mean all the Namai get to advance too. Like a known as warp core, which made it so everyone can warp long distances and explore more. Each clan has a festival envoy to show their most interesting work. Our envoy was Thatch. A single festival could last a long, long time. We can't go because we're stuck here, but Felix says we used to go too. Sad. Oh, hello. Of 
formation of this universe. No one knows how this universe was made, but one thing we do know is everything used to be very hot and very dense, tightly packed together. At this early as this early universe expanded, it also cooled down. Once it had cooled down enough, particles were able to group together to form things like galaxies, stars, and planets. Since then, space has continued to expand at a faster and faster rate, which is hard to think about for too long without your brain hurting. This universe will keep getting colder and larger until one day the stars and life they support will all die. That's scary to think about, even though Konoi tells me it won't happen in our lifetimes. It'll happen in someone else's someday. Is that what's happening to me? Because that's terrifying. <laughs> you know? That's what's scary. Where's the transporter? Warper thingy. Okay. Mm. How annoying. Just blocks my way. Need to get a long way down. Key. Bed at the table, yep, yep. We'll go this way. That is blocked. So this way is new. Look at that bridge. Oh shit, I'm just trying to fall. That's telling me to jump. Oh my god, that is so cool. Maybe back there. Oh, I'm not done here. Oh. Black Hole Forge District. Eye Shrine District. Meltwater District. School District. Oh. Wait, where do I want to go? Black Hole Forge? Eye Shrine? Hmm. All those. Oh, you can get off at certain levels. Ooh. What is this? Melt water district. And then further up you get. I see, I see, I see. Melt water. What does it do? Just a big bridge. The edge. Oh no! Oh no! Was that where I was? Oh god. I'm running out of time to explore here. I have to be so fast! It's over here. in city. So I've left it. Oh no! Everything's breaking off. Oh. This must go then, because I've already been here, haven't I? Yes, my friend is nearby. Just there. I get it, I get it. Gravity cannon. What is the gravity cannon? Too much to do here for one one loop. Oh, something's broken already. Shit. Mm. Go. 
Petite mèche. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I thought I was dropping. These aren't. No. Oh wow. Maybe the gravity cannon's gone already? I feel like my piece is about to go. What in the heavens? Nothing here. <laughs> Fucking hell, Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm getting scared. Did you go? No. Three minutes of oxygen remaining. Yay! I can go grab something. Oh dear. My friend. Can I get to them? change wolf hello oh thank you very much Oof. madness hello yeah i'm in a hurry i need have learned something the Namai escape pod. Wow, so then the Namai probably came here from somewhere outside the solar system and they must have been in trouble when they launched their escape pod. What kind of trouble? Where did the escape pod launch from? So curious. This is an amazing discovery. I hope we can find out more about how and why the Namai arrived here. Okay, I already know that. Alright, my friend. Um... Ooh, should I try and go to the tower? I feel like it drops though. <laughs> I feel like it drops. There's still so much upstairs I hadn't explore explored properly. I'm gonna go and get him from the top. Here we go. Okay, here's where it dropped for the Southern Observatory. I want in! <laughs> I want in! Okay, so this piece could drop at any second because I've left it so late to get here. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, would you look who it is? Would you look who it is? Beneath your feet lies the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Right. The trees are moving. The trees in this grove wander about freely. The entire plant, roots and all. This is not normal, even for this alien planet. And I never see them move. How is that even possible? If anyone else witnesses this disturbing behaviour, I implore you, record your observations here. Either these trees are are, are aberrant, or my brain must be. Flume is right, the trees do move. I confess I didn't notice until I read his notes. Alarmingly, it isn't only the trees. There is only other matter in this area, such as that unusual shard of rock moving this eerie way. That rock is unusual, for another reason too. It possesses colour and texture I've never seen elsewhere on this planet. Hypotheses. This rock shard presence is significant. We should study it. Could it be what is causing other nearby objects to also move about this area? It sounds like that is the case. So... It's rubbing its power off somehow. How do I get in here? <laughs> mm, let me in! Ooh, I missed a bit. 
You're preparing to make your first pilgrimage to Quantum Moon, descend the stairs, the entrance below. The knowledge held within will help you on your journey. So maybe I can can get in that way. <laughs> it's true. Oh, they've put things up here. Gloom, Felix, and I have determined this atypical shard of rock is the reason objects in this grove are behaving in a quantum manner. The only other object we've observed displaying this quantum behaviour is the wandering moon. Imagine the moon's behaviour in this grove are related. In her note from earlier, Felix mentions this strange type of rock isn't found elsewhere on Brittle Hollow, whether it isn't originally from this planet. Hypotheses. This quantum shard is from the wandering quantum moon. Perhaps it is even a small piece of the moon itself. Of note, a unique signal is coming from the shard. Curiously, our friend the wandering moon sounds the same. I've also heard the same signal the shard produces calling out from Giant's Deep, Timber Hearth, Hourglass Twins. I suppose there are other shards like this one. Yes, 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 yes! I was here! I was here with this knowledge! Um. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Not even if I look away from you. It's gonna be... Is this something new? Hmm. It's still the same one. Ouch. How cool! So your other objects pick up the ability to to shift. I want to find out more. <laughs> How? Does that mean this is about to drop? Oh yeah, we're dropping. Oh, dang it! <laughs> uh, and it shoved me off, hasn't it? Okay. Right. Curious. Great. Fab. Can I still visit places? Where did it go? Oh, ouch. Oh, sorry, sir. I think I'm about to die. <laughs> I think I'm about to die. The question I always have is, should I just reset? Or just let what happens happen? Well, my ship is very far away. <laughs> I'm very far away from everything. God dang it. God dang it. Where is the tower? Maybe I can only get to you when you break off. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, well, I'm here. And the music's dying. Can I get in here? What is this purple stuff? Where's the crystals? Not helping me now, are you? <laughs> I don't think I'm going to learn anything else if I stay in this loop. Well, I'll just check. I think my ship might die first. Hmm. Gone in 60 seconds! Wow, nice! Um... The, the, let's try that again. I was about to say... I don't even know what I was about to say. How did I do that? Oh, I must have walked off there. Distracted. Right. Right. Let's go. 
We have a lot to do. I can't remember what I was gonna say. Ooh, what's that red thing? I think what I was gonna say was, I swear. What is happening? Ship, you are crazy. <laughs> Where are these? What is that? What is that? My landing gear is damaged. What is this red thing? What? I can't keep having thoughts, and then something in this game distracts me. What the hell? is this I think I was about to say the time limit loops are hard for my brain oh what is that should I get a look at it I wish there was a way to put the brake on Calm down. What is this thing? Did I not? Oh, I did. Deep space satellites. Ooh. Who made this? Can I get in it? What is the point in this deep space satellite? How interesting. Oh god, where's my ship? There she is. I need to repair you. Um, I'm so sorry. Where are you hurt? Where does it hurt? Where's the damage? <laughs> I'm wasting so much time. Oh, screw it. I'm sure you'll still land. I'll make you land. Time to go back to this thing. <laughs> no, this. No, this. Yes. Take me there. Safely this time, please. Please don't crash into anything else. Oh no, a bit broke off. Oh, you shit. So what is the deal with Brittle Hollow? Like, why is it being destroyed now? You know? Like, it's perfectly... Should I just go in the volcano? <laughs> I think I found, um... Ryback's ship. Can't get in, though. This must be where they landed. I'll just put mine next to yours. Um... I'm guessing you got in here. Thought I'd come in a different direction. Try it out. Oh no. I'm here! I did it! I put the ship down safely. Um, in that ship went down and I didn't sustain bodily harm. <laughs> a few minor repairs and it's like the ship never even hit those rocks. One of my better attempts. Feldspar would barely have laughed at me a bit. It is really hard to control. I don't blame you. That's the good news. The bad news, I uh, haven't found a way inside this structure yet. The door is broken, and I know I'm not great at exploring, but I think I would have found a different entrance by now if, I, if there were one. But probably. I can't get inside from here, but I know there are paths below the surface. I'm going to head north to the ruins in the equator to find a way down. Ah, uh, I can't even get in here. Who broke this? Who broke this? Ah, you just walked? I'm gonna fly, I think. Yeah, why on earth is a uh, is brutal hollow breaking now? And not before. Okay, we're gonna get hit by one of these. Jeez, this is dangerous. This is very, 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 very dangerous. Oh no. Okay. Um, hmm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm just gonna 
land you here. <laughs> I'm gonna unbuckle you right here. Um. Hmm. Oh no, this goes up. Oh god. Oh boy. this call the shuttle home activate the gravity cannon That do. <laughs> Everywhere I go, <gasps> I'm just getting more confused. What's this? Mysterious. Yeah, this must break away pretty soon. Because I swear this was not here earlier. So I should probably hurry. God, this might be at the Southern Observatory. Ooh. 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 Cool. I'm here after watching it wander the skies for so long. I'm about to stand. For the first time on the quantum moon. As expected, my shuttle has landed at the moon's south pole. I'll make the remainder of my journey on foot. I don't know why the quantum moon always welcomes its visitors at the south pole. Just that this is true. As a child, I considered such unknown sinister. Now, though, I understand they bear no ill will. The universe is, and we are. I am ready. What? How are we? Am I about to? Okay. Whoa. What did that do? <gasps> oh no! Oh. Oh, I think I might have left everything behind. Um. Does this go to the quantum moon or do I just not know where I'm going? <gasps> Whoa. What? What happened? What happened? Oh, I'm back. Hey, what? Did I not do it? Okay. Woo. Where on earth are we going? Something doesn't feel right. Do I have to be looking at it? Maybe? It just takes me back? What? Okay, so we want to get going. But then... Where is the moon? Is that it? <gasps> oh no, I think that was it. Maybe I had to wait for it to orbit. Oh shit. 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 I think we need to go back. 
Take me back. Okay. Um. I need to find the moon. Oh no. Okay. Let's let's go again. Okay. Which one yeah, gets it going? Okay. I think I'm about to lose that in a minute though. Okay. 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 I've got to find this moon. Um. Where is it? Maybe that's it. I've got to look at it so it comes back, right? Ah, oh, God, that's so, so annoying. It was perfect. It was perfectly set up. I didn't realise. Mm, I'm gonna fly out of here if I can. Go on. Dang it! <laughs> it's, it's so difficult. Wow, am I just going to sit here now? Why have I then asked to go back? It's so interesting. Huh. I don't know if that was what I was supposed to do, but that seemed so hard. Oh my god, I saw it there! I blinked! That was cool! That was so cool! I'm gonna land... Here. I think. I'm gonna lose my ship here, but... It's fine. Oh gosh, too hard, too hard. Too hard, too hard. Every time I try and explore this thing, it breaks away. So I'm going to do it nice and early. You know? Nice and early. How do I get in? How do I get in here? Hmm? Is this breaking? Who is this? I'm sorry, what am I doing here? Oh, whoa. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, no, no, no. I don't like that. I did not like that at all. <laughs> whoa, okay. Ah. Oh, God. Bloody hell. All these planets confuse me. Now what? Now where is there to go? Over here? I don't know. I don't know, this seems really far. Oh, don't suck me in, black hole. Okay. What the bloody hell? Where am I going? What am I doing here? Don't look, don't look, don't look. Oh my god. <gasps> this doesn't seem right. This does not seem right. This does not seem right. Ow! Screw you. Follow the light. <laughs> oh, I think I gotta follow the light. Okay, come on, help. Yes. Yes. No! What do I do now? Over there? I'm just gonna get sucked in. Oh, I know it's there. <sighs> Motherfucker! My god! Sorry for all the swearing, I'm just so scared. Okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh my god! Is this it? Ah! Where on earth have I gone?
I'm guessing you're the my friend down there. Oh dear. Go 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 go. Relax. Go 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 go. Relax. <laughs> Relax. Oh gosh, was that something in the wall? I hope not, because that was too far for me to jump. I'm too scared for that one. What in there? Oh. Oh boy. I did it. I did it. I did it. Whoa. What are they? Oh no, the music's freaking me out. Oh god. Whoa. <gasps> Wait, is that that? This is that observatory. Oh my god, get out of this quick. What are they? Oh, I don't like tornadoes. Tornadoes scare me. I've had so many nightmares about tornadoes in my life. What is this? Oh, the sounds are freaking me out. Cassava's construction yard has been using the cyclones on Giant's Deep. Oh, that's why I don't want to go to Giant's Deep. My, my brain subconsciously knew <laughs> this was going to be bad. Okay. It's been using... Cassava's construction yard has been using the cyclones and giant's deep to lift orbital probe cannon parts into orbit. One component was pushed down past the current that usually prevents anything from sinking. It's why I now crafting a model to determine why this happened. An update, it's now clear there are two different types of cyclone. Most cyclones on giant's deep rotate clockwise. These are the cyclones Cassava typically uses to send components into orbit also exists a rarer type of cyclone that spins in the opposite direction and pushes objects beneath the waters and below the current. My gratitude spire. Conway Conoy is showing me your handiwork. I'm intrigued by the secondary type of cyclone. But was it really necessary to build a model to tell me that? <laughs> the model will be useful as we continue monitoring Giant's Deep. I also very much wanted to make a model. Can I touch it? Or are you just going to expel me places? I don't want to leave. Which thing just takes me to the top room? Okay, that one goes down, I think. This one must go up. Oh, oh grand. Very interesting. Not all terrifying. Can I go open this door? Oh, but it's not going to stay open, is it? But it is open for me now. Okay. Cool. Interesting. Ooh. Try and eat projection stone. Are you gonna project me to Giant's Deep? What is the purpose of these stones? Can I grab anything while I'm here? Let me see that again. So I can see exactly what's going on right now at Giant's Deep. But why would I want that? Mm. Ooh. <laughs> I don't like the look of it. Jump! Mm. What else is there? Can I be for this? you do anything? Noi, Daz and I were lifting the orbital probe cannon components into orbit for assembly and one somehow sank down beneath the current. Conoy, you should have seen it. We thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but ours sank straight to the core. Kasava convinced me not to try to recreate the phenomenon myself using other cannon parts, but we're very curious to know how to know what happened. How could some anything how could something pass through the current? My gratitude for your interesting question. This is exciting. Spy constructed a model of Giant's Deep here at Brittle Hollow's Southern Observatory, and it reveals how an object might sink below the current. Conoy, and I'm able to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pool. If I visit the observatory, would you kindly explain? 
you don't mind the trek beneath the surface of the South Pole, I'd be delighted to see you. There are two trailheads, one at Brittle Hollow's Gravity Cannon and one at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. God, it's gorgeous in here. This is very interesting, but very confusing. So this bit worries me. I'm got these stairs. Gonna run out of fuel. What are all these? adding them to the oh i see so that's ash twin timbaha is what is this one brittle hollow giant steep yeah that bramble yeah and the eye huh wow cool Unable to determine orbit. No signal detected matching any known criteria for the eye of the universe. Where is it then? Oh, they can't find it. Do you think it's because it's, it's the quantum moon and it keeps moving? So they can't, like... That would make sense why they ended up at Dark Bramble that one time. Because maybe it was orbiting it. Music is freaking me out. How should our methods change as we continue our search for the eye of the universe? As we couldn't find the eye signal using two different devices built for this exact purpose, we should discontinue the search method. We know what the eye looks like thanks to the quantum moon. So what if we try to find the eye visually instead? Let's send out a probe. We need to build a probe launching mechanism to cover those long distances quickly. A cannon in orbit around a celestial body would circumvent the need to escape gravity's pull. That thing I was using? Giant's Deep would be a good choice. It's first from the sun, so it provides the best angles for launch, and it's moonless, except when the quantum moon is visiting. Okay, build the cannon in orbit around Giant's Deep. Is that that thing I see breaking? Mello's idea is clever, but we have no idea where the eye is in relation to here. The probability of launching a probe in the correct direction would be absurdly small. I believe I have a solution for that problem. Have you spoken to Rami and Pai about the technology they're developing? Damn it, where's Rami and Pai? Is it like signal scope, finding out where the moon is? What is that thing downstairs then that I was trying to use? God, this is intense. My brain hurts. Oh, I missed one. Just too excited about all this. What have we learned thus far in our search for the eye of the universe? Those of us on the vessel originally followed the eye signal to this star system, but we were unable to walk to the eye itself. The locator we built on the Atoll Rock and the new, more sensitive locator we, be we built here were both unable to detect any trace of the eye signal. Suppose that oh god, suppose the eye doesn't wish to be found. Hypothesis: the eye has stopped emitting its signal. Kasava, how can you suggest that the eye signal called out to summon us in the star system? I'm aware. I grew up hearing the eye story, yet we're no closer to finding it than you were when you first arrived here. It's freaking me out that the music stopped. Oh, okay, here it goes again. <laughs> Based on our knowledge of the quantum moon, we believe the eye is in orbit around this star s system sun. This would mean the eye is located within a finite, albeit enormous, range. Oh, okay. So that's where the quantum moon goes then. The sixth location. We gotta follow the quantum moon somehow, and how it, and when it travels. I'm closing our eyes when standing on it. We can't even stand on it. It doesn't work. That must be why they're studying all these rock pieces. Maybe. Hmm. It's interesting. Hmm. 
guess I could try and get to the quantum tower again. Where's my ship? All the way over there. Find a way in. She just took me here instead. Oh god. Well. Something. I want to go in here. How's its st structural integrity? Surface integrity, 19%. That's terrible. Just because I landed on the balcony. Go. No, it's 19%. Pictures of all, all that moves. Oh! Oh, does that tell me where the moon is? Oh! Oh! That would make sense. Right? Oh, I could use this. Oh! It's still moving. <gasps> I could use this and um go to the I think I was trying to go to the cannon and like then no does that make sense how am I going to get to the cannon does the cannon disappear can I see it from here? Oh, this is a good idea. I like this idea. Best idea I've had all, all, <laughs> all day. All day. Yeah, we already read this. We need to move again. Oh, apparently you're at the eye right now. That made everyone. Right. <gasps> fuck. 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 Fuckity fuck. Wait, what? How did I end up in here? In my ship? Am I still in there? Oh! Oh! I land on that? Oh my god, it's so close to it. Um, hold on, I keep forgetting that <laughs> I can click because it wasn't working before. Um, I would like to go towards that, please. Please and thank, thank you. Can I land on this? Am I going to be able to land on this? I don't know. Can I get out of here? <laughs> oh, it's fine. Uh... Can I walk around this? <laughs> Run out of fuel. Stupid, I can re refuel in my ship. Donkey. Eh, eh, no. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, I didn't have probably I don't have long life to, <laughs> to do any of this. Um I wanna know if I can get in here. It doesn't look like I can. This is way too confusing for me. Can you chill out, please? Oh, but I can... 
Oh, because I'm not worried about flying near anything anymore. Oh, I can get in here now. Wait, which way was it? Up. Oh my god, I can get in. Oh my god, I'm in. I'm in! I'm in! Oh my god! Is this how I'm supposed to get in? Oh, this gets totally destroyed though, the moon finder thingy. Wow. Okay, wait, 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 wait. How do I... <laughs> how am I gonna read? Can I... Here we go! Welcome, Salonum. Your arrival here means you've completed your preparations in Giant's Deep and are ready to depart for the Quantum Moon. On your pilgrimage, the Quantum Moon will carry you, just as it carried me and many in our clan before me, to the moon's sixth and most secret location. You'll be aided in your pilgrimage by the shrine our clan built on the Quantum Moon, but remember this final rule. To explore the sixth location, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. Oh. Oh no, I've got like no time at all to read any of this stuff. How am I gonna do, how am I gonna explore this tower in time? I'm about to die. And there's so much stuff in here. Huh. Is this the way in? Is this the legit way in? I don't know if it is. I think I'm about to die. But there's loads of stuff in here. I know, I know. So dramatic. Great. Now, over here. Okay. Me. Me. Um, nice. Okay, some dark ramble. It's here. Okay. Just have to wait. I see it. Just gotta wait until I see it. I have no idea. It left! Why did it leave? On. It's now at the eye. Great! Who knows how long it's going to be there for. Hmm. It's still there. It's going to break soon. I think it might have broken. I think it might be falling. Damn, it didn't work. Oh, it's back. Why did it break? Interesting. Well, that means it's not ramble. So, I'm trying to look around, I guess. Where is the ramble? Uh oh. I think my thing's fell, fallen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now it must be broken. And there's the... Wait, is that the moon? Mm. I don't know anymore. This can't be right. I'm definitely doing this wrong. This is too difficult. <gasps> it's here. Okay, everyone. Don't no, no. Okay, we just wait. No. Ah, I see it. Fuck. Fuck. God dang it. Screw you. God dang it, Moon. You are so hard to catch. Okay. Last thing I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna go to the. Giant's Deep. 
That's the last thing I'm going to do today. I'm recording ages. I'll probably cut loads of it out because I'll just keep messing up my landings. But I'm leaving with more questions. Again. You know? Where is Justy? What's that? Bloody... Mm. I'm going to lose you. Oh, no, I didn't. Well, I'm happy that I've seen it now. I think I understand it a little better. What is that there? Damn. Oh, God. I'm about to die. Bye. Right. How does one get on here? You, you know? Okay, there's that thing. Can I... I can't do that. Can I look at it? Why did it explode like that? Oh no, it's the cannon. <gasps> oh, that would have been handy. Oh, for God's sake. I am terrified of this thing. Ooh, lots of storms. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, God. I did say I was going to look at it. Can I just land on that instead? Yes. Ew. Oh, there it is. There's that damn bloody moon. Okay, it seems to, the moon seems to like Giant Steep far more than it liked Brittle Hollow, so maybe this would be a good one to launch from, but I think this might be broken. I think it might be broken, um, and now it's gone forever. Let me just see this, see this thing. Hello. serious oh god oh my god i'm falling in oh my god this is horrific <laughs> i'm just letting whatever my ship needs to do happen oh for god's sake oh. Ooh, are they jellyfish wow can i go see them Oh, I don't think my ship's very happy about this. Can I look in? Wow, ooh, that looks very dark rambly. Um, I don't think I can control my ship properly, <laughs> given how damaged it is. But it could be the water. Who knows? I'll just get out. Chill out. I'm getting out. Um, I don't know if it's going to let me out here. I did. Well, I'm here. This place looks terrifying. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it here. I think I knew that I wouldn't like it here. What is going on here? Oh no, that's ghost man. Oh my god. Do they move? Is that coming towards me? Yes. Jesus. This is horrific! 
just gonna have constant anxiety when I'm here. I'm not gonna like that. Let it pass, let it pass. What in the? What in the? What is happening? Where am I? Where? What is that? Weird red things. I am so confused. I honestly couldn't tell you what just happened. Can I go inside this thing? Oh. Mm. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, they're very far away. Well, they're not that, oh, they're not that far away. May as well, while I'm here, you know. Can I even get over there? I feel like I'm being swept away. Go, 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 go. Hi! How on earth are you able to relax here? Hi! Nice. It's you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solar launch is a doozy, isn't it? I can't remember my first launch now. Where did I go? That Athel Rock, I think. So, hey, don't freak out anything, but lately I keep, like, dying repeatedly. I don't know, it's pretty weird. <gasps> Wait, it's happening to you too? What about you? Have you died lately? Or is it just me? No, it's me too. We're in a time loop. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah, a time loop makes sense. Cool. You're taking this pretty well. <laughs> right back at you. Personally, I like the new experiences. I've never been in a time loop before. I mean, I don't think I've been in a time loop before this one. Looks like you and I are the only ones who can tell time's gone all weird. I tried radio and horn fells and asked if they'd die too, but they thought I was being metaphorical. <laughs> Even if I tell horn fells about the time loop, they never remember by the next one. They don't realise anything's different. And here's another weird one for you. Every time I die, all my mem memories from that loop replay back to me. I'm pretty sure that's related to this big stone and my statue I found on one of the other islands. <gasps> I was looking at it, and the statue opened its eyes and started glowing. You were telling me my own experience. It replayed my memories like it's seen them through my own eyes, just like what happens each time I die. That happened to me with a statue at the museum. You too, huh? Then in my statues must have something to do with why we're the only ones aware of the time loop. So, no glowing statue, no time loop awareness? I think that's going to be my leading theory. If you find anything new about the statues or time loop, let me know, okay? I'll be here. Anyway, what's, that's what's new with me. But hey, this is your first solar voyage, kind of. Let's talk about you, you know? How's space treating you? Oh my god. Well, apparently I found something. Oh, your quantum poem. Yeah, the one in the woods. I remember writing that. Pretty fun, right? Works out to, to a good 24 poems. When I'm done exploring, I want to make some more quantum art. Maybe some kind of creature sculpture like that. Just like shows up and scares the daylights out of you i mean the rocks already do that to be honest have you ever watched a cyclone for so long it started to hypnotize you i'm telling you they'll put you in a trance and stare at them long enough no thank you um oh, apparently nothing else uh, what are you doing out here well what are any of us doing here really now nah, i'm just kidding i'm out here exploring our solar system same as you but I tell you what, outer space really gives you room to think. It's quiet and peaceful out here. I mean, it's usually quiet and peaceful. Sometimes a cyclone comes by and lifts my little paradise clean out of that water. Then, less peaceful. Oh, it lifts it up. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah, that model did say it would do that. Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash in the sky. Something must be happening up there in orbit around the planet. What? What else? What else? Have you been to Statue Island? That's where I've been calling it. Seen as it's the island where I found the glowing Nomai statue. Get it? I was on the beach on Statue Island where the whole glowy business happened. 
by the way. It's a nice beach for that kind of thing. I give it a solid 7 out of 10 on the Grabone <laughs> relaxation scale. If you feel like checking out the Statue Island, it's the one with the two islands connected by a natural rock arch. Well, mostly connected anyway. You'll see. What's up with this planet? I know, right? Oh, you meant like tell you more about it. I gotcha. Well, Giant Steep is massive and mostly water. No surprises there. There's a strong current always beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. Seriously, I've tried everything I could think of to get past that current and neither idea worked. I gotta try all these cyclones to try and get there, haven't I? As for land masses, I've counted four islands, including this one. It's also the one with the Namai statue I saw on the beach. You've seen the cyclones? Yeah, they're hard to miss. They'll toss everything up in their, their path, islands included. Little tip, if you get picked up, try to land in water. That's likely to kill you. Wow. Where's your ship? That's a good question. It's definitely on this planet somewhere. I mean, unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space, I guess. Oh, that's probably what's happened to mine. Um, heh, that would be pretty nuts. I hope it's not lonely. Oh, no, mine's still down there. Well, that was interesting. I'm guessing you haven't been able to go in here. When can we go in there? Hmm? Am I going to find something? Oh, help me. God, okay. Maybe I should have had a good look at the models. Oh, no, wait, that one is turning in a different direction. Isn't it? Yeah, that must be one that goes down. Should we go test the theory? <laughs> I feel like I might have found it, but who knows? Maybe not. It's definitely turned in a different direction. For sure. I'm hoping the other one doesn't touch me before I get to it. Um, would you be able to take me downstairs? Not sure I can get in. Well, maybe I need to... Hmm, let's see. I think you need to pass over me, or I need to come in from the top. That's a bit annoying. Well, this is a horrible planet. Don't like it. Will you take me up then? If I try to go into you. Do you accept me? Okay, you were. But the one going down said no. Which was really interesting. Hmm. How am I going to be able to tell? From up above. Like, do I have time? Mm. Well, the more I hang out with them, the less scared I'm getting, so that's okay. Well, do you want to go in there? Yep. to go where my scout is. Where my scout is. Hopefully land in the right one. There. Quite impossible. Actually quite a peaceful here. <laughs> now I'm used to it. Oh hello. Um, I know. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get in. You're very unwell, aren't you? Where is my stuff? I swear to God. One more bloody percent. That took ages.
Okay. Here's it. Ooh. That was a massive one. Wow. Wow. What's with this huge one? What's with you? Um, okay, let me look at these. That one's going the right direction. They're all going the right direction. That one's going the right direction. Yeah. That work? Hmm, didn't fling me deep enough there, did it? Ooh. It's like, um. Yeah, it's like a magical <gasps> jellyfish build. <laughs> I'm gonna guess you're not friendly. What about the top of you? Can I touch it? <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh god. Major system damage. Okay, fair enough. Wait, wasn't there supposed to be a creature here somewhere? Are you talking about the jellyfish? I'm, I'm about to die anyway. Whoa. Whoa, what was that? Was that I just hit the massive cyclone? That was an insane plan out. That's just so stressful there. I was feeling a bit more peaceful, but now all the electrical jellyfish have me worried again about it. Oh boy. I got a pause for the day. I feel like I did nothing again. I feel like I made no progress. I'm just keep exploring. I'm the same bits over and over and over. I've been recording for so, so long. So, so long. Um, right. Well, that breaks apart, which is fab. <gasps> Maybe it was a shuttle leaving it. Oh, and it's broken. So where did the shuttle go then? Oh, maybe it's that person that was supposed to go on the shuttle. What are they called? Maybe they've used it to go on the quantum moon because I then I can't then see them again. That would make sense, right? I don't know why I'm putting that on because I can't quit. Oh, I haven't been here in a while. I just said I didn't do much today and then I have to sit through all of this. Okay. So, Landum. Maybe that was them? Using the shuttle? Ah, dang. My brain hurts. I think I need a break. I need to go think about my options again. Probably, um... Edit. And see what else I notice in editing. But I am not. I'm out of here. Hopefully that was fun to watch. I feel like I've been really mellow when playing this. I just need to think about what I'm doing. You know? But I can't believe I never noticed that moon before. Today. <laughs> Be funny to watch my old footage and see if I can see it anywhere. But yeah, that was really cool. That face is as terrifying as I thought it would be. And uh, Dark Bramble also seems rubbish too. <laughs> every, every planet scares me. For some reason, apart from this one, I like this one. Uh, yeah. I can't even say anything. I'm just fried. Rain fried. And uh, hopefully it won't be too long for the next part again. And I'll see you all very soon.